This is the ministry of God's love, compassion and mercy, taking the gospel to huge multitudes with signs, wonders and miracles. Though based in Dubai with 90 services for a week, as founder and senior pastor of King's Revival Church International, Pastor Dil Kumar continues to bring the message of God's love around the world, receiving salvation, miracles, healings, as God comes and wipes the tears of the broken heart and fills them with life and life in abundance in Jesus' name. Miracle moments, healing and blessing festivals in many nations draw crowds to a million to receive the love of God and be healed by His power. Miracle School for Healing and Wholeness teaches and imparts and raises God's servant as fathers to minister in the fruit and gifts of the Holy Spirit. Our Miracle Moment TV programs are seen worldwide taking the gospel with signs, wonders and miracles instantly following God's word. We also run children's home for orphans, homeless kids and take care of widows destitute in different countries. Beside these, we pioneer and oversee and support many missionary churches and nations. The books authored by Pastor Dill such as Jesus Christ Heals You Right Now, True Anointing and Gifts of the Holy Spirit, Miracle Life in Abundance, Miracle Life Now and Forever, Your Miracle in the Kingdom of God are available on request. Our magazine names, signs, wonders and miracles are widely circulated with credible documented healing and miracle testimonies, praise reports. Our website www.yourmiraclelife.com Our email godslove at yourmiraclelife.com Please be in touch with us for any prayer requests. He will certainly bless you and grant you the needed miracle in your life in abundance. God really loves you. She has suffered with a pain in the heart. She says she felt like someone was pulling it out. Today, the Lord has healed her. It's gone completely, she says. My daughter, come here, child. Come here, child. Just take your hands off. All the pain is gone, child. Completely gone. Don't cry, my daughter. These tears will never come again. These tears. All the pain is gone, child. You can move your body and show me. All the pain is gone. Look at these tears of joy. Lift your hand to Jesus. So when she came this morning, she fell down from the taxi and her leg was swollen. The Lord healed her completely. It's gone. The pain is gone. The swelling has gone. My daughter, my daughter. Oh, my child, look at me. I'm a good man. You can look at me. Where is the pain? Where is the pain? It was swollen like this. Now it's gone. And the swelling also has gone. You can move like this. Now you can walk well with me. My God, my God. Oh, who healed this dear guy? After for long, 26 long years, he had this knee pain, oh, left yes. pain. Last Sunday, it's through gone. the word of knowledge, he's been completely healed. All the pain is gone. 26 years you had it, son. My God, my child, just move your legs up and down, son. All the pain is gone, completely gone. Who healed this dear one? Who healed this dear one? It's all Jesus. It's all Jesus. This is a Thanksgiving. Yes. The child had severe wheezing on Sunday. They could not come to church. They were watching you over the internet. The word of knowledge came through you that the child will sleep peacefully and the wheezing will be gone. That night she was healed completely. Completely healed, child. You watched me live. Uh, and completely gone. No ice cream. Nothing, huh? Jesus has healed you. Jesus loved you, my daughter. Your daughter is healed. Lift your hands to Jesus. Pastor, she had eye pains and watering of the eye for three days. The Lord has sealed her completely this morning. All the watering and the pains have gone. The watering has stopped. Little children give glory to Jesus. The pains have gone. The watering in the eyes have stopped. Lift your hand to Jesus, my child. He loves you. You will be a testimony for Jesus. Pastor, for four days, she suffered with the pain in the heart. Today, the Lord healed her. It's gone completely. All the pain is gone, child. You can lift your hand and you can move your body or whatever. All the pain is gone. You can take a deep breath. 
All the pain is gone, child. Who healed this dear girl? Who healed this dear girl? Who healed this dear girl from the heart side? It's all Jesus. Pastor, this is Mary. She has an amazing testimony. For the past three days, she had severe swelling and pain and bleeding in her gums. She couldn't talk. She couldn't eat properly. She came by faith today to sing in the choir. She said all the bleeding has stopped, all the pain has gone, and she's rejoicing in Jesus' name. The pain has gone, child. The bleeding has stopped. And the swelling has gone also. The swelling has... Let your hand down. The swelling has gone, my daughter. Swelling, bleeding and the pain as she said. Who did it all? Lift your hands, my child. Lift your hands to Jesus. Lift both your hands, my daughter. And say thank you to Jesus. Pastor, she had a problem in her kidneys and it, there was a stone in her kidneys. The doctors advised surgery. But as she trusted Jesus, Jesus healed her in the place. The stone has come out and everything is fine. Everything is fine, my daughter. Lift your hands to Jesus. Lift your hands, my daughter. It's all Jesus. It's all Jesus. Pastor, she has two testimonies today. For one month, she's been having itchiness in her left palm. But today, Jesus healed her. All the itchiness is gone, Pastor. And My God. All the blisters and the wounds, everything has got dried up in Jesus' name. Bless you, my daughter. Your faith, my daughter. Your faith. Yes, child. And Pastor, also her son and daughter in grace met with an accident and they were in ICU. But the Lord Jesus Christ healed them and the doctor said they are out of all danger. Yes, my your prayer, my daughter. Your prayer, my child. It's your faith, my daughter. It's all yours in Jesus. Pastor, seven years ago she was in an accident because of which she hurt her neck and she's been having pain ever since. Tonight Jesus healed her. All the pain is gone. All the pain is gone, child. You can move your neck up and down, left, right, oh, all the pain is gone. You can move your neck up and down, all the pain is gone. Look at the joy in this face. Lift your hand to Jesus. Lift your hand to Jesus. Pastor, this is Sheila. She's had a severe back pain for the past one week. And she said, by the word of knowledge, as you called out the sickness, all that pain has completely gone. All the pain is gone, child. No more pain at all, my child. You can bend down and show me. Can go like this and show me. All the pain is gone, child, completely. Who healed this dear daughter? Who healed this dear child? Who healed this dear girl? Everyone say, Jesus. He loves you, my daughter. He loves you. Someone's pain here on your ears, on your ears, on this side, on your ears, just now has gone. My loving children, don't feel shy. Just come. Pastor, this is Beatrice. Just now, Pastor, by the word of knowledge, you said pain on this side of the cheek. And that is Beatrice, Pastor. And all that pain is completely, completely gone. Completely gone, child. Gone. Can, you can move your neck and all. Completely gone. Just now when I told. It just went. Lift your hands to Jesus. Pastor, she has two miracles today. For three months, Pastor, she had a severe pain in her left hand, Pastor. The pain is gone. She couldn't lift her hand and now she can lift it. And secondly, Pastor, for two years, she's been limping. Today, that limp is gone, the pain is gone, and she can oh, walk. That's marvelous, that. You can move your hand, child. My Lord, you can move your leg. My daughter, all the limp is gone. Who healed this dear girl? Who healed this dear daughter? Everyone say, Jesus. Jesus, live, my daughter. Live always. Pastor, for the last four days, he's had a painful throat infection. And was with difficulty able to swallow his saliva. Now when he came, it's completely gone. gone. You can swallow, my son. You can you can swallow and show me. Just swallow something. It's it's going in. It's no problem at all. I'm going to give you my tea. Now you drink it. Now you drink it. How is it? Tea is okay or this is okay? Uh, coffee is okay or this is okay? It, how is it? You can going through beautifully. Take another sip. Hallelujah. Wonderful. Lift your hands to Jesus. Lift your hands to Jesus. Pastor, for the last six months, he's had pain and stiffness on his right knees. This morning when he came, he could not bend it backwards like this. The Lord has healed him completely. You can run and walk and show me. My God, all the pain is gone, son. Completely gone. Lift your hands, my dear. Lift your hands and say thank you to Jesus. Everyone say thank you to Jesus. Pastor, he had a severe back pain. He couldn't get up uh -huh. from there. He's seated. He needed support. As the word of the Lord came, the power of God came upon him. Now he's healed. He can bend, Pastor, without any pain. My son, just bend down, son. 
It's a severe pain. All the pains is gone. Look at him. Do it more. You look so nice when you bend down. Bless you, my darling. Bless you. Who healed this dear son? up and walk in we Jesus' name. today. He is here today. He will forgive every sin of ours, never to remember again. Mark's Gospel, chapter 2, verse number 2. He was found in the house. The news spread where he is, and people thronged, and the Holy Bible declares further, it, many teachers of the law, many theologians, many educated people, many literate people wanted to hear him. And he was there. The Holy Bible declares he preached the word unto them. My loving children, wherever the word is preached, Holy Spirit will be there to confirm that word. They just came to hear his word. His word is life to you and me. That's why they came. John 6, verse number 63. His word is life to you and me. My loving children, many times when you want to give up, many times when you want to withdraw, many times when you want to go back, and say, God, nothing is happening in my life. Nothing seems to be good in my life. Nothing seems to be progressive in my life. There seems to be no good door opening in my life. My loving children, don't ever believe the defeated devil. He's a liar. Jesus Christ is the door for you and me. His word says he is the door for you and me, my loving child. Today, there is a door opening in your life. A door for peace and joy and life in abundance. Today, believe your sorrows will come to an end today, this morning. Today, believe all the defeated diseases in your body will cease to exist. And even the symptoms will not be there. You look for symptoms, you may find them. But when you look for healing, it is there in your body already. What you look for only, you will find, my loving child. He is here today. God wants you to look out for your healing in your body. God wants to look out for peace and joy in your life. God wants you to look out means you just expect, Lord, this is all that I'm going to receive today. I have heaps and loads of problems. I have sorrows. I have difficulties. I have uncertainties. I have challenges. I have controversies in my life. But I have come to your word, God. I have come to hear your word. I have come to listen to your word. I have come to receive receive your word. I don't understand everything, God, but I receive your word. Even if you don't understand, God's word is not limited to your understanding. Only believe. Lord, I don't understand everything. I understand nothing, God, but I believe if you have said I am your child, I am your child, God. If you have said, I love you, I know you love me and I believe you love me and I receive that you love me, God. My loving child, his word is life. Jesus said in Matthew 4, verse number 4, you will not live by bread alone. It's not by just your effort. It's not just by our effort or our intelligence or our intellect. Oh, my loving child, you and I will live only by his word. 
by the word that proceeds from the Father. My loving child, Jesus said, it's not my word, it's my Father's word. John 5, verse number 20. He is here today. He loves you. John 14, 24. It is my Father's word. It is all his word. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word is God. John 1, verse number 1. And the Holy Bible declares, this word became flesh. His name is Jesus. John 1 14 when you come to his word my loving child his word is life for you and me my dear child he is here today in every situation his word his word is life his word is healing he is sending his word to me and you I don't bring the word of God who am I nothing he is the word I receive his word for me and to you my loving children I'm just a delivery boy. I'm just a messenger. I'm just a conduit. I'm just a pen stock. I'm just a pipeline. It is he who is the word. I don't bring a word. I take his word for me and for you. He is the word. Lift your hands to him. He is the word. He sends his word to you and me today to heal us, the Bible says, and to remove every destruction from your life and my life. My loving child, are you thinking today God things are not working right in my office things are not working right in my family things are not working well in my heart in my mind in my children's lives in my physical body my loving child today all things will work well for you all things will work well for you if it has not done before it will start now in Jesus name because his word has all power Romans 8, 28, all things will work well for those who love the Lord. My loving child, are you here loving him more than anyone? Are you here loving him and him alone in this house? You may not know him, but just believe that he loves you. And just for the sake that he loves you, you love him. Return that love, Lord. I hear that you love me and I too love you, God. I also love you, God. I will also love you God you have loved me oh my loving child he has loved you with an everlasting love John 13 1 says Jeremiah 31 3 says 1 John 4 16 19 18 says he is love my loving child his word is love his word is life his word is healing he is here today they came to him because his word is love his word is life his word is healing my dear child he is here today he is here today. Everyone came to him. Everyone came to his word. I am here for his word. I am here for his power. I am here for his love. I am here for his mercy. I am here because he is there that I am here. My loving child, because he is there at the right hand of the Father. You are also here, my loving child. Streams of Miracle Life is Pastor Dale's latest book. Every module in this book is anointed with the power of God and His truth. There are also testimonies and praise reports that confirm God's living word. As you read this book, believe in the Lord Jesus and you shall have life and life in abundance. Without him, we can do nothing. John 15 verse 5 says, Why we bring these quotations from the word of God? So that you will not believe on the enticing words of man's wisdom. As Paul the great apostle said, 1 Corinthians 2nd verse number 4, that you and I will not believe the enticing words of man's wisdom, but rather believe in the power of the living God. My loving child, his word is power. He holds all things by the word of his power. Hebrews 1 verse 3 says that, my loving child, when we bring it from the living word of God, this word is now bringing faith into your life. My, whether you know it or not, whether you like it or not, whether you accept it or not, God's word will do what it is sent for in your life and my life. No defeated devil can stop that.
my loving child you may say God but I am loaded with problems I have no money to pay the bills I have no money to pay my children's education I have no peace at home my darling child today this morning his word will do all things well in your life and my life if you let him now, if you let him, God, I don't even understand how it's going to happen. I don't even know how it's going to happen. I don't know, even know when it's going to happen. But all I believe is that it will happen. Isaiah 55 verse number 11. Isaiah, why we bring you these words? We want you to know these words so that every word, his word, brings faith into your life and my life. God says, Isaiah 55, verse 11, my word will prosper you. My word will do what it has been sent for. He loves you, my child. You just, as you listen to this unworthy man, you just put your hand on your heart, close your eyes, so that your attention will be on him, so that you will not be attracted or distracted to anyone, or by anyone, or for anyone, or with anyone, that there is only one person whom who you'll know in this church. There is only one person you will remember in this church. His name is Jesus. Close your eyes, put your hand on your heart, and say, Lord Jesus, Jesus, Lord Jesus, I believe you. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, I trust you. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, I love you. My loving child, my beloved children, what has happened now, you will know it later. He loves you, my dear children. Those are being widely opened in your life in Jesus' name. My dear, dear child, he is here today. He holds all things by the word of his power. He loves you. Everyone thronged and loved his word. He never condemned anyone. He never came to condemn anyone. Luke 9, 56 says, he said, I have never come to condemn anyone. Luke 9, 56, John 3, 17. He loves you, my loving child. He loves you, my beloved ones. There is no condemnation. He condemned no one. He loved everyone. Forgave all who came to him. Rejected none who came came to him my loving child you may be anyone here if you say God with all my burdens I am coming to you Jesus I am coming to you Jesus Luke 7 37 he will never reject you he calls you everyone who carries any burden in your life your mother and father may forget you your own family may desert you my loving your own friends will let you down but the one we preach from the Bible, he will always stand for you. The one to whom you can come all the time. You can be any religion. God doesn't know a religion. God only knows the blood of his son, Jesus Christ. That's why this is God's table. This is heaven's table. This bread and this wine. This memorial that we have. That Jesus said, do this as often as you can in remembrance of me. My loving child, he loves you. Your problems will be over any time now. Your sicknesses and diseases will depart any time from now. Your pain and your agony and your fears will cease any time now. You will live, I will live in Jesus Christ until rapture as we live on this earth. My loving children, my beloved children, he is coming soon. He is coming soon to rapture us in midair. We are not going to live through tribulation or the wrath of God or the judgment of God. Believe me, there are no op opinions needed. The gospel is one and Jesus Christ is the same. My loving child, you and I, as we live on this earth in these coming long years, will be suddenly, supernaturally, it's a secret, sudden, supernatural, snatching away of God's own elect in Christ Jesus, washed by the blood of the Lamb of God. Holy God, you and I will never pass through those tribulations. You and I are straight going into the marriage supper of the Lamb with rewards and crowns 
and later in the new Jerusalem in our father's mansions it's all going to happen anytime but until then you and I shall have a victorious life on this earth expect your victory all the time and expect Jesus to come in midday. These are the two expectations in your life and my life. Expect your miracle anytime. Expect your life in abundance anytime. Expect your sickness and your disease and your pain and your agony and the sins and the weaknesses to leave anytime. Expect all the sorrows to depart anytime. Expect your victory at every part of your life anytime and anytime Jesus may appear seen secretly, suddenly, to snatch us away. These are the, don't expect that you're going to lose your job. Don't expect that you're going to fall sick. Don't expect the works of the defeated devil. My loving child, how many of you believe that? Oh, my love, many times you say, oh Lord, I am expecting I may lose my job. My darling, you will never lose because he holds all things by the word of his power. Believe today, your health, your family, Oh, my loving child, believe. And they just were there for him. They believed every word. And the Bible declares, I love that word that blesses me all the time. There was no room for anyone to get in. The house was packed with people. My loving child, when Jesus comes in, when his word is all that you need, when his word is all that you love, I tell you, beloved, there can be nothing else of the defeated devil to creep into your life. Jesus loves you. And my books are there. Jesus Christ heals even now. Jesus Christ heals even now, my book. My latest book on rapture, my beloved people, everyone washed by the blood of Jesus, everyone who loves Jesus is going to be taken up in midair very soon. We are going to be raptured as we live on this earth in these coming long years. We are going to go into our father's mansions. He's going to come in midair to take us, rapture us. My latest book on rapture, don't miss that. And my powerful book, because Jesus lives, you will live also. Because Jesus lives, you will live also. And then streams of miracle life, streams of miracle life. Get these books. My magazines, every three months we put out magazines, signs, wonders and miracles. Every three months we send them internationally and it's full of credible documented evidences of God's instant miracle healing works testimonies praise reports in our magazines you can send your request we'll get it across to you signs wonders and miracles magazines all our miracles it's increasing john 14 12 greater works greater works now until rapture it's increasing it's increasing we will send you our magazines signs wonders and miracles send us your prayer requests send us your requests we will pray with tears and you will receive your miracle. We love you. And more than us, Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. And you can watch us on various television channels as well. Jesus loves you. See you again. And Jesus loves you. Mm -hmm.